Uh, hello, good people of Ableton. I'm just here to talk to you about some updates for my vocal harmonizing rack, which uses the new auto shift, which was just added in Live 12.1. It's very cool to have pitch correction built into Ableton after all these years. It's cool to have formant shifting. It's working great for me. I hope it's working great for you. Uh, so I will first just go over the basic version, which is free to download. It, there's a link in the description below. And essentially, this all relies on the global key being set here in this global scale mode section. So this sample is in D minor, and that's really all that this harmonizer needs to work. So there's some basic controls over the speed of the auto-tuning here, and the strength of it, and the formant, and just some vibrato just for fun. And, and then we have three degrees, well, two degrees, and then an octave up and an octave down. So I'll just give you a little demo. I don't need no reason just to get it fired up Just try You give me that feeling when you leave me tied up You can get it if you need it You can get it when you need it I said I don't need no reason just to get it fired up You give me that feeling when you leave me tied up You can get it if you need it Okay, and so now let's let's take a look at the deluxe version, which I've just made the version two of. I had a couple of people purchase it, which for which I'm very grateful, and they wrote to me and asked for a couple extra features, and I thought they were great ideas, so I have integrated them, and I'd love to keep this back and forth going. If you, if you grab this and you see something that you think it's missing, let's talk. I'm happy to to work with the users and make something that works for everyone. So. Before we had preset scale degrees here, just like the free version, but now what we've done is we've basically, we have five parts, one, two, three, four, five, and the bass. And for each of these parts, you can just set whatever scale degree you want. And I think that's just much more, you know, it just makes it so that everyone can get exactly what they want out of it. So we'll start with just the bass. Um, we still have the bass form and control here. I don't need no reason just to be fired up. You can me that. And then we have the speed which we can pull down real short if we want the classic auto-tune song. To get it fired up. And then we also have a bass verb. Uh, my, my little family, my wife and our little baby, we were recently in Chioggia, Italy, and we were touring through some old empty churches. And so I recorded some impulse responses there, and I turned my favorite one into a reverb that's used in Ableton, and I think it sounds... Quite dreamy, and I hope that it works for you. So I'll just give you a little taste of that. Very nice. So let's get into the parts. Um, so essentially, this first one is set to two degrees, and we will give it a play and we'll turn it off. Second. You can get it when you need it. Third. Say I don't need no reason just to get it fired up. Fourth. You give me that feeling when you leave me tied up. You can get it if you need it. You can adjust these as you go and find the perfect shape. You can get it when Some are going to sound better than others. Say I don't need no reason just to get it fired up. High one here. You give me that feeling when you leave me. Another thing I've added is the ability to change just the formant of all the harmony layers, which can get some nice effects like so. We've also added separate verbs for the harmony. I've actually added many different verbs. So each layer has their own reverbs, which I feel makes it sound more realistic because it's like each voice is in a different space just to add a little more width and, and interest to the sound. So we'll turn that on here. We'll turn off the bass and we'll turn this one on. I don't need no reason just to get it fired up. You give me that feeling when you leave me top. And then we've also got another sample here, which is in a major key. A major, and we'll just give it another try here. You make me feel that there is no else. 
So I hope this gives you a little, just a little taste of what, what can be done with this little rack. Again, thanks to the people who have already purchased it. It's much appreciated, and I hope you're doing great things with it. I would love to hear what you do with it. Feel free to send things over. Again, if there's things that you think are missing, you want me to throw in, let me know. I'm happy to work with you. Um, I think that's all. Thanks for your time. Peace.